Hello Leo, Sun and Rising and Venus and welcome to another reading. Let's see the overall energy for your reading for today. So we do have release your ex, the time has come to clear your energy. Then we also have reconciliation and engagement. For some of you this could definitely represent an on and off relationship between you and this person. But let's see what's going on. We're going to focus on you. The first thing that came to my mind um, just now is is it really over is it really over so it kind of looks like somebody's trying to figure out if the situation is really over or not that person could very well be you or that person could be somebody that um, you're energetically connected to but anyways let me stop getting interrupted uh, Leo, we're going to focus on you first and we'll jump over to your person. Just keep in mind the roles can be reversed. Also, keep in mind time is fluid. So this could either currently be happening or maybe happening at a later date. All right, Leo. So we do have the Empress for you. We also have the, um, okay, Two of Cups for you. And then we also have the Ten of Swords for you. At the bottom of the deck, we got the uh, Four of Cups to the Emperor to the Judgment card. I feel like it's this person. I feel like it's this person that's wondering, like, okay, like, is it really over? Or are we going to get back together? Like, what? what's the deal? What's the deal? True pair situation here between you and this person. We do have the Empress as well as the Emperor. So you guys are very compatible. Oh, great. My candle just went out and I can't work without it. Hold on. Okay, we're back. Um, sorry, as I was saying, um, as far as like your overall energy is concerned, um, it, it kind of looks like you're done for now. Okay, it kind of looks like you're done for now. Of course, you might find yourself having a, all of a sudden change of heart when it comes down to this entire situation here between you and this person. But if, if I'm just going based off of your overall energy for right now, it kind of looks like you're done uh, with this person. I kind of still feel like you're still grieving the loss of your relationship with this person. But as far as like, you know you making any sort of attempt in their direction to try to bring this relationship back together all over again i really don't see you doing that if anything i kind of see you trying to move into a place of acceptance that it's over and done with uh between you and this person but i feel like this person's like man like is it really over like is it really over between leo and i like is it really really over um okay See, I feel like you're at least making the attempt to move into a place of acceptance of this ending that transpired here between you and them. They are not. They are not. They are not. How does this person currently view this relationship? Oh, there goes the emperor with the ace of pentacles. They're making some type of grand gesture in your direction. hold on this is not okay wait a minute i hate when the messages come in freaking quickly okay this person's making some type of grand gesture in your direction this person might have something delivered to your house or to your job and it's something tangible it's something tangible yeah it's something tangible they might have something delivered to your job or to your house um, let's look at this Ace of Pentacles. We have the Page of Cups out here. Whatever this, this thing is that they're having uh, delivered to your house or to your job, um, it, it could have a letter attached to it. With the Page of Cups, this could definitely uh, represent that this person could very well be apologizing to you for something that they either said and or did. I just feel like this person is trying to make things right with you. Like, they know that they messed up. That's kind of besides the point. Nobody needs to tell this person this. Um, but, yeah, like, let's just say for a perfect example, like, I don't know, like, this person's having, like, roses, you know, delivered to your job or to your house. There could very well be, like, a note attached to it. Um, and it could very well be them apologizing to you in that note. You know what I mean? Um, for others of you, there may not even be a note attached to these roses or whatever that you're receiving. Um, there may not be. Um, but it's just them, you know, trying to basically show you that they're really, really sorry. Like, they're really, really sorry. Okay, let's keep going. How does this person currently feel? Mm. 
Okay. We have the... Somebody's being brought to their attention. Someone's being brought to their attention. Somebody's being brought to this person's attention. It's the King of Swords energy. Aquarius. Gemini. Libra. Possibly another Leo. Maybe even a... Somebody's being brought to this person's attention. Who is this King of Swords and what is your relationship to them? Is what they're trying to figure out. Who is this King of Swords and what is your relationship to them? I don't know. <laughs> and I don't even know who this King of Swords is. I guess we're about to find out. But um, I'm trying to find another way to say this. Because this is very like uh, the way that it came at me. I'm like, yeah, I'm not going to say that. Um, I feel like, okay, I feel like this person just wants to know. Okay. If you and this king of swords are seeing one another we'll say it that way because that sounds a lot nicer than what i originally got um but yeah this 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 emperor wants to know who this king of swords is for one um and have you ever you know you know what i mean with them okay see i found a nice way to say it <laughs> okay how does leo currently feel we have the lovers we also have the temperance card i really need to look at this king i need to look at this king i need to look at this king whoever this king of swords is we have the lovers we have the temperance card and then we have the seven of cups i feel like this is you patiently waiting for the right one to come along i don't feel like you're looking for love i feel like you're just choosing to sit around and just wait until the right one comes along you're choosing to not look for love you're choosing to allow love to basically find you. Okay, nothing wrong with that. Uh, okay, well, I, I mean, I want to see who this King of Swords is. Uh, what is this King of Swords relationship to this Empress? This person might be... Um, well, okay, maybe that's what's... I mean, because I, I am kind of getting that. This is not going to resonate for all of you. This person could very well be looking at your social media leo and they may have noticed that you started um following someone you know like this king of swords whoever they are and they could very well be thinking to themselves like hmm like what's going on like with these two like are they you know dating each other are they seeing each other are they messing around like what's what's what, what's up with these two huh what's up with these two like there's somebody that's catching this emperor's eyes okay um not their eyes their attention jesus christ there's somebody which is basically this king of swords that's capturing this this emperor's attention which is leading them to think okay wait a minute like who is this because i know that this is not a friend of leo i i know all of leo's his friends who is this and are they messing around are they i don't know maybe i, don't, I mean i don't know i mean i don't think so but um what is Leo's relationship to this King of Swords. <laughs> okay, so we have the Seven of Wands. We got the Judgment card. We also have the Ace of Swords. And then we also have the Ace of Cups. Well, if I'm being honest, okay? Whoever this King of Swords is, I mean... I mean, it is somebody who's interested in you. I'm not going to sit here and say that they're not. It is somebody who is interested in you, but something's holding them back from pursuing you. Tell me more about the, um, it could be, it could be because you guys live at a distance from one another. It could be because this person just recently got out of a relationship and they might feel like they're not entirely ready for anything right now, but it's either because this person lives at a distance from you they may not even live in the same state as you do leo let's just be real they may not um for others of you it could just have a lot to do with the fact that this person recently got out of a relationship uh so they don't necessarily feel like they're ready you know for anything right now um but are they interested in you yes do they find you to be extremely attractive absolutely um you're definitely their type on top of that but what's really holding them back is either you guys don't even live in the same state as one another or they live extremely far from you or they just got out of a relationship 
relationship and they don't feel like they're ready for anything. Um, so I don't feel like you've ever been romantically involved with this person uh, whatsoever. I don't. I don't. Mm -mm. I don't feel like you've ever been romantically involved with this person in particular. Okay, let's keep going. What actions? Uh-oh. Remember, they had the page of cups um, on their behalf. So we have the page of cups. We have the seven of swords. And then we have the uh, four of cups. Hmm. I'm sorry, Leo. I just, I feel like whatever it is that, you know, they're doing on their end, it is going to, it is going to cause a lot of stuff to come up to the surface for you all over again. It is, unfortunately, I'm sorry, but it is going to cause a lot of stuff to come back up to the surface here for you. Unfortunately, you are receiving an apology though from this person. You are. Um, I don't want it. Let me see. Let me look at this. Because I don't know why I'm getting I don't I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it. Tell you more about the seven of swords of the four of cups. Oh. Yeah, I'm sorry, Leo. I'm really sorry, but i f I'm so sorry. But I feel like whatever it is that they're doing on their end, it is gonna bring a lot of stuff back up to the surface for you, and it might even make you extremely emotional. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Tell me more about the Page of Cups. We have Judgment. We also have the King of Pentacles to the Two of Wands. And then we also have the um, Star. I just feel like this person wants you to give them another chance. Whatever it is, I feel like they have, I feel like this person is having something like delivered to you, like your house or your job or something like that. And I feel like there's like a note attached to it. I'm sorry, Leo. I feel like it is going to bring a lot of stuff back up to the surface for you and it might make you extremely emotional. I'm sorry, Leo. I'm sorry. What actions? We have the Hermit. We have the King of Swords. No, we don't have the King of Swords. We have the Six of Swords with the Queen of Wands. And then we also have the Empress with the Seven of Wands to the Ace of Wands to the Three of Cups. Okay. So whatever this thing is, right, that this person has... Uh, being delivered to your home or to your job like i said it has like a like a note attached to it like they're apologizing to you for something that they either said and or did and i also kind of feel like this person's asking uh for a second chance now like i said i don't feel like you're gonna be too happy about it because it is gonna bring a lot of stuff back up to the surface here for you with the queen of wands so the six of swords so the hermit coming out here for you um even though it's showing up on their overall energy, it kind of looks like they're more than likely not going to hear from you, to be completely honest. Um, they're more than likely not going to hear from you, okay? Um, I just kind of see you choosing to retract your energy, okay, and not give in to this entire situation anymore. I feel like you're telling yourself, no, don't take them back. We got to move forward. We got to move on with our lives. Like, we, we can't let them back in. We can't let them back in. We can't let them back in. Um... well um what's gonna end up happening here between leo and this person yeah you're very determined you're very very determined to let this go you're very determined to not let them back in you're very determined to move forward and move on with your life very determined to do so yeah i feel like this is you kind of telling yourself nope mm -mm, we're not doing that Leo, we're not doing that again. Nope, we're not. We're not going to do that. We're not going to do that again. We're moving forward. We're moving on with our life. We're letting this go. Like, no, we're not. Nope, 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 nope. Like, I feel like you're kind of, you know, having those type of conversations uh, with yourself um, in regards to this entire situation that you're going to eventually find yourself in, unfortunately for you, Leo. Um, but we have the um, Justice card. We got the Ace of Swords. We also have the uh, King of Wands. And then we also have the Eight of Wands. So, here's the thing, all right, Leo? 
I do see you deciding to not say anything to this person. I do see you deciding to just retract your energy from them and just pretend that you never actually got the roses after all, right? They're going to find a way to talk to you. That's kind of besides the point here, okay? They're going to find a way to talk to you. Whether that's by them calling you, texting you, or actually showing up at your house or your job. Like, they're going to find a way to talk to you. I just kind of feel like this is them, like, breaking the ice, if you will. Like, that's just kind of what I'm kind of gathering off of all of this, is that this is just their way of breaking the ice here, okay? So instead of them calling you or texting you, they rather send you, you know, flowers or roses with a note attached to it, you know, telling you how sorry they are, and please, please, please give me another chance, right? That's just them breaking the ice. That's it. That's that's all they're doing, is just breaking the ice, just to see how you're going to respond and react to it. it doesn't really look like they're going to get the reaction that they're looking for because I feel like what they want is for you to turn around and call them and text them. I don't even see you doing that. Um, so I kind of see them taking upon themselves to just contact you directly because um, they're very determined to have a conversation with you. Mm hmm. Yep. By the way, you guys are showing up as, an, you know, as a true pair again. I, I know you don't want to hear all of that, but I'm just... You know, I, I guess I thought I'd let you know. I don't know. Um, what else can you tell me? We have the Emperor. We have the Eight of Pentacles. And then we also have the uh, Wheel of Fortune. Oh, they're determined. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This one over here is determined. They're determined to get you back. They're determined to make this ins entire situation uh, work out here between you and them. They're determined to make sure this entire situation plays out in their favor. Let's look at let's look at this person's um, overall energy with the uh, love messages. No communication. Tell me more about the emperor. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Tell me more about the emperor. Okay, you know what? Let's just stop there because this is a lot. All right, so we have the card that says, I hurt myself by letting you go. We also have the card that says, I know I hurt you and I don't want to hurt you again. So then there's that. Um, oh, I'm trying to be someone that you can trust. So maybe trust was broken here. We also have, we need to let each other go. I feel like that's what you're doing. I mean, this did technically speaking land on the Empress. And then we also have, please don't hate me for ghosting you. You didn't deserve it. Maybe they did ghost you. I highly doubt that they did. I mean, that with the cards that came out, I don't believe that they actually did ghost you. I don't believe that they did ghost you. I just feel like this person doesn't want you to continue to hate them you know, based off of whatever it is that they did that caused this ending here between you and them. Let's see how you're feeling. Well, we kind of know how you're feeling, but let's just see. So we have the card that says, um, please understand that I need space right now. And then we also have the card that says, I will take action soon, please believe in me so maybe you might decide to text them or call them after you receive these roses you know what i mean i doubt it to be completely honest um it just kind of looks like you don't really i mean the thought might cross your mind we'll say that the thought might cross your mind to call them or text them but mm -mm. I don't, I don't see you doing it in the end um then we also have i self-sabotage this connection and i regret it Maybe you did self-sabotage this connection somehow, some way. But if I'm just going based off of the cards here, I don't necessarily feel like you did self-sabotage this connection here between you and this person. Because they're the one over here apologizing to you. Like, they're the one over here trying to make things right with you. So I don't feel like you did anything on your end. Yeah, but like I said, the card that actually landed on top of you, which you are the empress regardless of your gender, gender, was this card <laughs> was this card that says we need to let each other go you know i feel like you're trying to let them go i feel like you want them to let you go um but it looks like they don't want to leo um it looks like they don't want to sorry okay um but that's what i have for you leo hopefully the reading helped hopefully it resonated also too for those of you who want to follow me on instagram the link is in the description box down below also to you guys i got a tiktok now 
Mm -hmm. Can you believe it? I have a TikTok now. It's actually linked in the description box down below for those of you who want to follow me on there. Um, but yeah, hopefully the reading helped. Hopefully it resonated. And I will see you guys in your next reading. Bye.